Hey guys, welcome back to my channel today. I hope you're doing good. So in today's video, I am going to be showing you some lipstick swatches on a new holiday collection set by Stila. This one is the Star Studded 8 lipsticks. I already took them out. They do give like a glare. So it comes with eight liquid lipsticks and six of them are their regular matte liquid lipsticks and then two are brand new shimmer colors. And I am wearing one of them right now. This one is called... What is this one called? This one's called Sogno. I think that's how you say it. And that's the one that I'm wearing right now, in case you're curious. So that one is the first one, most likely, that I'm going to be swatching for you. And then I accidentally swatched a red one after that. And I was like, no, that is so bad for swatches. I need to go from lightest to darkest. But anyways, okay, let's get into the swatches so that way you can see all of the colors. And now I just want to show you each one and just tell you what I think about each one because one of them is like really drying and not only drying but a little bit patchy. I don't know if you noticed in the swatches, but they are, they can be a little bit different. Like it just depends on what color you get, what the formula it has, if it's like a light color or a very dark color. Sometimes you'll notice that in a kid, one of them just doesn't really work. Starting off with this one. This one is the nude one that I'm wearing right now. And this one's actually my favorite out of the entire set just because it's really comfortable. It's really matte. And whenever I smile, I always do like the smile test. That's my little thing. Um, I don't like to see my lip color in between. And when that happens, it's like, I don't know. I just don't really like it. I feel like it makes my natural wrinkles just show up even more. Like, I don't mind them being there. It's completely normal. But if I'm smiling, I don't want little cracks to show through you get what I'm saying so this one is my favorite one which I'm really glad that I like it because it's the most wearable out of the entire kit so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be wearing this one the most the next one is this darkish red one it's not like super bright and I was surprised that I actually liked it I really did like the tone of it and I like the way that it felt I was like please don't feel dry because you're like a little bit of a darker shade but it didn't it felt comfortable it was nice it wears nicely and it lasts a long time like all of these are super long lasting like I have to really try to remove them in order to take them off but yeah this one very very nice I'm just gonna go ahead and swatch it for you so you can see it on a swatch but it is a dark red and I forgot to mention something about this one this one is just a little bit dry looking it doesn't feel dry it's like really comfortable and like I can talk easily and move my lips and everything but it is just a little bit like 
like like a normal liquid lipstick i guess should be but it's just a little dry okay and the next one is this one this one's called aria and i really like this one and i also like the way that it looked on my lips it was not super drying and i'm gonna go ahead and just show you the clip that whenever i am resting my lips like whenever i'm not smiling it you can see my wrinkles but it is like a very comfortable wear and i don't mind seeing like my little lines because they're there i mean i have them it's just normal it's natural but i also don't see like like dry cracks in between you know i know it sounds kind of weird but there are some liquid lipsticks that just look super dry on the lips so that one the one that i'm talking about is this one which you just saw like on my lips but i'm gonna go ahead and just show you the swatch so you can see the difference between each shade so this one is the Rebel. This one is the darkest color in here. And you can tell from the lip swatch that it looks a little patchy, which is really, really weird because I was looking at the camera. Like I can see the viewfinder like right there and I can see my lips. But whenever I see it in person on the mirror, it doesn't look patchy. But I guess because the light is hitting it, I do have a window right in front of me. I mean, just in person for some reason, it didn't look patchy, but on camera it did. So that means that it probably is. And I have to say that again, it's it's the darkest shade out of the whole collection which it happened to me with three elf uh, liquid lipsticks that I tried previously the darkest shade which was pretty similar to this one also looked a little patchy so I don't know if it has to do with the formula of darker colors but for some reason they just look a little patchy and they're very similar colors so I'm like maybe it's the color itself maybe it's me maybe it's the way that I'm applying it but I'm just letting you know this one looked patchy on camera but not in the mirror and I'm gonna go ahead and swatch this one next to the dark pink this one is a dark like very vampy color the next one that I also liked is patina and this one is a dark pink which you might think looks like the other one but now it's a lot lighter it's a dark pink, but it's not darker than the top one. And this one is also one of my favorites from the entire little kit. Not only is it super wearable, but I also like the way that it feels on my lips. And it just looks even. It looks nice and it feels comfortable on my lips. There's not really anything else to say about it. I mean, it just worked out perfectly fine on me. The one that didn't, though, is the last one, the light one. Well, the last one of the matte ones, this one is called Perla. And this one is just a tone of it. It just does not work with my skin tone. I feel like... I don't know, it just doesn't look very good on me. It's a very, very light nude. But this one just looks way better on me. This one, I don't know, it just it just isn't for me. The color just doesn't work out for me. It's a little bit dry, just like this one. Like, it's a little bit. It's not uncomfortable to wear. It's just the tone of it. It just doesn't work. And then lastly are the two metallic ones, or the two shimmer ones, I mean. This one is actually patina, so the same shade as the matte one, but this one has the shimmer. And I'm going to swatch both of them. My camera turned off. <laughs> I'm going to swatch patina next to the matte patina so you can see the shade. And I was like, okay, that's good. Like, I do like the tone of it, and now I get to try it in a shimmer formula. So it also worked out really nice. Like, these, I feel even feel a little better than the matte ones like the matte ones are a little dry like that's how matte liquid lipsticks are but these feel good on the lips i thought it was gonna feel a little gritty or it's just gonna feel i don't know a little bit different but no the shimmer is actually very very light shimmer i'm actually gonna wait for it to dry because you can't see the shimmer at all not yet so on the swatch it's not really i don't know i can't see the the shimmer but i'm gonna go ahead and just show you side by side on my lips because it's very obvious on my lips that one of them is shimmery and the other one isn't and we'll just wait for this swatch to dry but i mean it doesn't matter it looks better on my lips anyway the very last one i'm gonna go ahead and swatch this one next to the other red one this one is a bright bright red like what came to mind whenever i first put it on was an ornament <laughs> like a christmas ornament like those shiny red ornaments that's exactly what came to mind just because it's super bright and then you have the shimmer so i don't know it's a very very pretty red it looks really really nice on me like i mean i liked it on me and it's a very bright pretty red but like i said it does remind me of an ornament it's just very shimmery so that is the last one there it is compared to the darker one so you don't really get any repeats besides these two like even the nude one compared to the one that i'm wearing right now so here's the one that I'm wearing right now. I know I just said it very, very tiny. But these are the two nude ones, and they are different from each other. Like I said, the only two 
similar ones are these two because they're the same shade except this one is the shimmer side yeah that's pretty much what i wanted to get into just individual each individual shade just because i feel like i don't know for some reason there's always one that just doesn't really work out at least with the dark colors because i've tried other kits and all four of them look and feel really nice so i just feel like with the dark colors maybe it's a little bit different to make and that's why they can be a little patchy i'm not sure maybe it's also the way that i'm applying it but other like i apply i try to apply each one almost the exact same way and to apply like the the right amount and some of them just don't look patchy and another thing that i wanted to say is that if you miss a spot and you feel like you can see a little spot afterwards i already did this i already did this a few times and i apply it and then wherever i see the little spot that i need a little bit more on so that way you don't build up product i just go like this like i tap it with my finger and it won't let the product build up it'll just fill in that little spot that you wanted to fill in i don't know just an extra tip because sometimes it's obvious whenever you apply a second layer of lipstick all over so just apply it on that little spot and like tap it a little bit with your finger and like remove the excess and it won't like build up and get clumpy or anything on your lips that's pretty much everything for this video the swatches and i just tell you what i think about each individual shade like i said it is 49 what did i say it's 45 not 48 45 and you get eight in total and i will have the little kit listed below in case you want to check it out for yourself but that is pretty much it for today's video if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe before you leave so that we don't miss out on other videos and i will see you guys in my next one bye hey guys welcome back so today we got oh, what the, the, the. hey guys welcome back so in today's video we we me just me you're by yourself hey guys welcome back so today's